Use the polygon command to create a closed polyline entity consisting of 3 to 1024 equal length sides. There are a number of ways to activate the polygon command. You can select the polygon icon from the draw toolbar. You can choose the polygon option from the draw pull down menu. Or you can type polygon at the command prompt. Using these two one inch diameter circles as a reference, I will create two separate octagon shaped polygons. Select the polygon icon from the draw toolbar. Specify number of sides. Since we'll be making an octagon, we'll need to type in the value of 8 and hit enter. Specify the center point. Select the center of one of the circles. Specify distance option. For the first polygon, we'll use the corner option for a circumscribed polygon. This is where the circle will touch all the points of the polygon. Type CO and enter. Specify distance. Here you can type in a distance or you can select the point on the screen. The distance the draft side is looking for is the radius of the circle. Type 0.5 and enter. Notice that all the points of the octagon are touching the circle. Now I'll create my other polygon. Hit the enter key to recycle the polygon command. Notice that the number of sides defaults to the last value used. In this case, 8. Hit enter to accept the default value. Select the center of the other circle. Now we'll use the side option for an inscribed polygon. This is where the circle will be tangent to all of the straight segments of the polygon. Type S for side. Again, type the radius distance of 0.5 and hit enter. Notice that all the straight segments of the polygon are tangent to the circle. These are the two styles of polygons that you can create in DraftSight.